Hi friends, I am Sujoy and today I will tell you some basic concepts regarding number system which you will need to watch my next video and in my next video I will tell you everything about the conversion between the number system. For example, conversion between binary to hexadecimal, binary to octal, octal to binary and from decimal to octal everything. So don't forget to watch my next video and for now let's start. There are four types of uh, four kinds of number system currently in use: decimal, binary, octal, and hexadecimal. The base of decimal is base ten. That is, there are ten number of digits from zero to nine. Binary base two, two digits zero and one. Octal base eight from zero to seven, and hexadecimal base sixteen from zero to f. Now, positional number system: a number system with a specific number. As its base is called positional number system. For example, decimal number system. Here, in positional number system, the position of each digit represents its value. For example, three is in its position number one. So three into one, two in tenth position. So two into ten, twenty, and zero in position of hundredth, and one in position of thousand. So it becomes one thousand zero hundred twenty-three equals to one thousand twenty-three. Now digits. Digits are the finite number of symbols used in a number system. For example, for decimal number system, the digits are zero to nine. And base, the total number of digits in a number system is called base. For example, for decimal number system, the total number of digits is zero to nine. That is equal to ten. So base of decimal is ten. Similarly, for binary, there are only two digits, one and zero. So base of binary is two. You can always form your own number system using your own symbols, and the number of symbols in your binary number system will be the base of your number system. Non-positional number system. A number system without any base is called non-positional number system. Characters used are Roman one for one, Roman two for two, etc. Characters are a position invariant, means each character represents the same value regardless of its position. It is very difficult to perform arithmetic operations with such number system. For example, Roman number system. This is x or ten. This is one or this is five. So it doesn't matter whether this x is positioned here or here. It will always represent ten. Now, some number system used in computers. BCD. BCD stands for binary coded decimal. It's a simple binary code to represent a number. In BCD code, a decimal digit is represented by four binary digits. For example, five is represented by zero one zero one. In my next video, I will tell you about how to convert from decimal to binary and vice versa. So for now, know that five is represented at zero one zero one in binary. If a decimal number consists of more than one digit, each digit is represented by four binary digits. For example, twenty-five. Has two digits, so it will be represented by two as zero zero one zero and five as zero one zero one. So together, it forms the BCD equivalent of twenty-five. Accessory code. The accessory code is formed by adding three to the individual digits of a decimal number. Then the binary equivalent of that is accepted. So we will add three to each of the digits. So one plus three, that is four. And two plus three, that is five, and each is converted into binary. So four is zero one zero zero zero, and five is zero one zero one. So together, this forms the accessory equivalent of decimal twelve. Accessory is not a weighted code. That is, the sum of weights of binary bits is not equal to the corresponding decimal digits. Gray code, the gray code, also known as reflected binary code, is a binary number system where Each successive values differ in only one bit. That is a non-weighted code. Gray code is also called mirror code. So, friends, this was my tutorial. If you like my video, please like it and subscribe to my YouTube channel. That will encourage me to upload more videos. Additionally, you will get notified by email whenever I upload a new video. You can also follow my blog www. sujoy-tech. dot blogspot. dot com For more informative stuffs. So, friends, I am signing off. Don't forget to watch my next video. Stay connected.